lovely tune that is. I discovered this tune this morning, funnily enough. It's obviously been around for donkey's years, but it's one of Paddy Fay's reels. And um, I was searching on the internet for something, and I came across a website called OxfordSlowSession.com, and on there they've got lots of lovely tunes, including this one. So I was looking through, and um, they've got a beautifully notated version of this, so it's quite easy to pick up the tune. And um, they've also got a link to Martin Hayes playing the same tune uh, on a YouTube video. It's a beautiful version. So it was quite easy for me to, um, to learn this tune actually by listening to Martin and looking at the notation. And I also then found another link to Paddy Fay playing the same tune. Now I believe this tune is based on another tune called um, Never Was Piping So Gay, which is uh, one of Ed Reavy's tunes. Um, so I'm not quite sure of the, the actual heritage of this tune, but it sounds like Paddy Fay was certainly influenced by Ed's tune. Um, but it's a lovely version. And it's a lovely version that Martin plays. So I'm going to leave a link to his video as well, plus a link to the website that I found. And the nice thing about this website is designed for people first learning tunes, so it seems to be quite clear and easy to follow your way through. So I thought that would be interesting for you. Anyway, that was my version of Paddy Faye's Reel. It's not quite as slick perhaps as Martin's version, but it's it's within my own style, which is quite sort of forceful, I think. That's the way I am because I'm used to playing for dancers, you see, and you have to really drive out the rhythm. But anyway, what a lovely tune this is. Um, doesn't seem to be too complicated. The only part you may find complicated is the bit on the B section where it goes... something along those lines and you have to roll your ring finger across from the uh, D on the um, on the A string and you have to roll it across to the A like that that's a bit tricky I guess I'll show you what I'm doing Sounds dreadful, doesn't it? But there you go, that does work. Um, I'll play that B section again. part that might be a bit tricky is that sort of group of three notes. I suppose you'd call those a triplet. That bit. You have to sort of flick your wrist backwards and forwards very quickly. Just thought I would put this video up for you to look at and perhaps if you haven't come across this tune which I certainly hadn't before today then maybe you will enjoy playing along as well. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon.